Okay, so I think I am live over here on YouTube, but for some bizarre reason, Facebook is um, is an absolute ball ache. So let's. Um, I'm just going to try and. Yeah. So, um, so it should be going live any second now on um, Facebook. So let me know if you can see and hear me over on YouTube. And I'm just going to test it there. So, uh, looks like that is working okay. And Facebook should be going live any second. Hello, hello, hello. Facebook should be live. Okay. I'm just going to go in and test Facebook as well. So that should. Ready, should show me that we're live. Okay. I don't know if anyone else is struggling today. Uh, I've struggled with Groove and with, there we go. Let me know if you have sound. Hey Pauline, let me know Pauline, you can hear and see me. I'm getting a few issues. And I've got no volume. I have a feeling because I'm running it from my Robert Murray profile, it's not letting me view it. So you know what, I'm just going to go into Facebook and see if it'll allow me. So I hope you're well. You can hear and see. Okay, that's good, Pauline. Thank you. I'm just going to check and open that one there. You can hear me over. So um, I thought today, uh, obviously we've just launched, the, the Groove has just done its... Um, like closing out or exiting beta launch, too low FPS. I'm getting a dodgy frame rate is saying. And YouTube looks like it's playing okay. Hello, hello, hello. Facebook should be. Oh, that's quite a way back. So uh, I made the decision that I would be uh, building out a new bridge page. Uh, an affiliate uh, upgrade bridge page. So I thought. Uh, but in sorry. a meta cohesive uh, version, it's known as the experience. So I just opened up um, the Groovathon and it automatically started playing. That's Mike right now. Uh, probably, and, and actually thinking about it, I only literally thought about this this morning and suddenly threw it together. And, uh, and then I kind of realized that we, they've just started the Groovathon today. So probably. Um, not going to get a huge amount of people to be on, but that's fine. Uh, you guys can watch the replay. Yeah, a bit of interruption now and then. Yeah, it's seeming like I've had major issues on my computer today. Really poor. Um, so I'm going to just close everything down that I don't need. And I'm going to just dive on in. And what I'm going to do here is I've already got an upgrade bonus page, but it's been around for a while. Um, and I wanted to send obviously an email to all of the people who've got a free account through my affiliate link and just offer them the option of upgrading because obviously, as we know, the uh, Groove price increases very, very soon and then it kind of, the lifetime deal goes away forever. So I wanna make sure that all of those people have had their, their, their chance to see the software in action. So if I share my screen, 
Uh, and when it catches up, let me know, Pauline, that you can see that. You finished the whole eight days affiliate action challenge. Well done. Um, and again, I haven't been on that, so I'm sure David Lemon's shown loads and loads of things. Uh, he's probably actually covered some of this stuff. Uh, in fact, and again, didn't even think of that. I just, I just thought, you know what? I'm going to upgrade my page anyway. So why don't I just um, do a new version with new bonuses, lots of additionals, <coughs> and then ping it out there. So what I'm going to do. This is my original page. So save me editing it and losing it. I'm just gonna clone it. And you guys will catch up in a minute. Again, today I'm finding Groove very, very slow, like things like cloning pages and things like that, taking a long, long, long time. So I don't know if it's my speed or if it is a bit of both. Uh, so you can see here, it was doing this earlier. And then I went in here, started editing the settings, and then it sort of sorted itself out. So Groove Special Upgrade Bonuses. Let's change the name of it. Let's call it Groove Special Upgrade Bonuses. So yeah, so I'm just going to be building this out. I'm going to change all the bonuses out. Um, if you're already someone that's upgraded, that's fine. You can kind of just work, watch along, and ask questions if you want, or if you're watching on the replay, just you know carry on. Um, but I'm just going to kind of do it live, and then it just means that you guys might be able to pick a few bits up. Uh, I've not logged into Groove today. Not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure myself. It's, um, it's been a bit glitchy. So I'm just going to drag down here. This is the Groove uh, special launch page where they're doing obviously the Groovathon. You can see these kind of images uh, images they've used before, launch event special. Um, yeah, we did tell them that this was incorrect earlier. Sorry, this. Uh, we're exciting. It's supposed to be exiting. I think it's a terrible word exiting, but anyway, because people who don't don't know it was in beta, I don't know if they'd understand that. So 14 days, five hours, bonuses included, bonus one. I haven't even looked at this. Funnels Masterclass, uh, free bonus. Might feel sane. Uh, what are you getting this free bonus? Funnels Masterclass. Groovathon. So you're obviously getting all of the recordings, I'm guessing. Kind of cool. Uh, ah, <laughs> look at that. And where have they got this picture from? Because that's the um, that's my testimonial that they had on the other site. But someone's going to swipe that from my YouTube page, um, my Facebook page. I didn't send them that. That's a bit sneaky. I don't mind, but you know, it would have been nice if they just asked me. Um, that was having lunch with my um, my ex-girlfriend. Anyway, um, so the, again, all this has been updated. Lots of good stuff on here. Um, you know, this really would be the page that you want to be sending people to. Uh, let me come out of there. Does anyone else find that a bit glitchy? That's a bit. It's kind of too responsive or not responsive enough. Uh, you're famous, yeah. Yeah, I just didn't know. Obviously, I knew it was on the previous pages, um, Pauline, but I didn't know they'd updated it, and I didn't know they'd gone and swiped a new image from my my Facebook um, profile. As I say, just Kurt, I mean, they look like they've updated everyone's pictures, which is fine. But yeah, just I'm quite surprised I hadn't actually looked through this page. Um, so what I'm going to do is, if if you're Someone that's just starting promoting Groove today, or you you know you haven't really been promoting Groove, then I would be sending people directly here to go and watch the training. You'll have a link in here in your where are we Groove affiliate? Let's play the gauntlet with this. Okay, so there should be a link I'm guessing in here, or you can just go to Groove JV actually. Let's go to Groove JV because. It should give us all of that gump. So ideally, I want my bonuses page to look and feel like the pages that, that you know I'm promoting, obviously. Um, oh, this is the oh yeah, we're launching again. 
So let's have a look at our tools down here. I've already swiped this page. <laughs> um, come on, come on, come on. It's taking a while to load. So it's kind of promotional tools. Again, it might be my internet's running slow today. Where is this link? It's just groove.jv. Uh, sorry, groovejv.com. And it will give you all of your, um, all of the promotional stuff and I don't like the way that's that's not working very well. Look, it's not spacing properly. Um, price increase. So look, if we open up some of these, this could be the Groovathon, or it could be because I'm just want to make a decision on what page am I going to send people to. Well, this is my upgrade page, so I obviously want to send people to. So this is obviously the new uh, Groove. It's free page. So again, they've updated everything. That's cool. It's just not loading very quickly. It must be my internet is struggling. Yeah, so you can see here they're obviously offering the bonuses on there for the free Groovathon. Don't think that people are getting that for free. But maybe they are. Get started free. Okay. So it's very similar to um, to the other page there, isn't it? look at the top a lot I, mean, I like all the darker colors it makes all of this pop I like this I don't know if they've, they must have had that design because I like the, the way it, the coloring changes there so we've got a few different links we can use you can see here price increase it looks like that is pretty much the only link they're giving us at the moment oh no Last chance price increase Groovathon, the upgrade page. Again, I don't think they've updated that since I last looked. It was all that green. And so for me, because I'm building out uh, an upgrade page, I want to kind of model and, and marry up some of the colors here because obviously this one that I've had was pr the previous page I'd kind of color schemed it to. So, <clears throat> yeah, this is it. So it's got all the green and black, and for some reason their video doesn't fit. It's a little bit odd. Um, yeah, see, look, that's the image they originally had. Um, anyway, it's all good, it's all good. And it does help that, actually, that when people go to the upgrade page, I'm on there. Um, not a great deal, but it just, it, it just helps. So it's kind of great that they've put me on there. I'm just gonna have a quick look. Um, what else they're giving two free tickets to GrooveCon okay let's talk about GrooveCon lifetime Groove account 1397 49 minutes they've still got that kind of false scarcity on there which I'm not a lover of because as we know it is actually not updating so I like the fact they've got that there, the 299 Platinum Plan coming soon and September the 1st there. So, I mean, that in itself kind of eliminates the, 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 the scarcity there. And anyone who's worth their weight would kind of see that. So I, it's a little bit not a lover of that. Okay, so I'm going to match up my page with all of these colors. And let's get back to the top. So this is my new upgrade page. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna drag this one over to the top so that I can see that and you know what I could do Ooh, you know what I could do I could and I'm trying to save myself time here it doesn't always work at the moment but what I could do is grab the page source let's open up a new page I did it earlier on their new launch page and it, it worked and then it didn't work and then it worked and it didn't work and so I'm opening up the page source. I could go and grab that whole page and then just grab bits out of it and drag them in and move them around, if that makes sense. But you can see how slow my tinternet is going. I was hoping I can give funnel building a break then. Um, yeah, see how slow everything's going. Apologies. Do is 
So I'm going to stick with the upgrade page because there's no point in me, you know, all of my videos, my YouTube channel, all of that kind of stuff, it sends people to, I'm going to drag that one back up there, it sends people to the free page. And I'm pretty sure that, I'm going to get rid of that, and I'm going to get rid of that. So I'm just going to stick with one page builder. And let's see if that page source will load. It may not, it may not. Like I say, my internet is really, really struggling. Um, yeah, although I get that a lot. Does anyone else get that on Groove? I get that um, pops up all the time, like when I'm up, like publishing a page or something. So I'm also gonna open the source code here to see if I can, you know, I'm just gonna get rid of that one. The problem is once it starts doing that, um, where it's struggling, kind of does it for like two, three, four months. Let me just leave that and let that load. Hey, NM, uh, can we get this template, please? Yeah, of course. Of course. As you are on here live, definitely. Uh, if I can get the, the source code to actually load, it could be quite a big, well, that's not a huge page. So... Come on. Don't do this to me. I'm just going to move OBS and have a look, see how YouTube, uh, for YouTube's and a few issues as well. Ah, here we go. I didn't even notice. So I'm just going to click into the page and then do Control A, which may take a few seconds. It gets smoothly, or my internet was running smoothly. That would have already got highlighted all of that blue but I am having a few issues, as you can see. And the problem is I've got my Bitcoin trading is in, in the background. You can see how slow it's going to Okay. Yeah, so I've got that going in the background. It's not a lot I can do about that. Come on, come on, come on. This is not perfect <laughs> when you're trying to do a live build. But this is the reality of building a funnel or building online or, you know, not necessarily with Groove. It just, my internet today in Spain is going ridiculously slow. Um, how can we get it? Should I send you by email? Um, what I'll probably do at the end is I'll grab the share. Um, what I'll do is I'll put the share link in the chat in a bit once I've figured out that it's going to actually give me that. Um, and I'll just put the share link here so the people who watch it on the replay can grab the, the page. Oh, that's really not good. I don't like it when that little spinning, um, spinning wheel starts kicking in. pretty sure that we've got a bit of a freeze going on. If you can hear me, uh, I'm just trying to be patient, not touch anything because I'm having a bit of a chrome freeze. If you are still there, make a comment. I've got a feeling everything's frozen, which is not good. And this has happened two or three times down on, um, on Groove. Damn, damn. Hmm. Oh, you can hear me. Okay, good, good. Okay, you can hear me. Right, you know what I'm going to do? Let me quickly just go back over here. I'm pretty sure, pretty sure um, that I had previously done what I'm just about to show you where I went and grabbed the source code. So I'm going to get rid of that source code for a second. 
So it might be easier for me to quickly look in my funnels and just save the page as a template. Um, obviously my internet is struggling, so I'm kind of pushing it to do something. So I'm just looking for that green and black page once this loads. Uh, I could actually, let's leave it. Um, Cause that was updated quite a while ago and I'm pretty sure, don't quote me, I'm pretty sure I downloaded it. But you can even see just scrolling down, see how that's got to the bottom. That isn't the bottom of where my funnels go. So I'm waiting for it to load the next part. And actually, I don't like that the work that where they've done that with Groove. Maybe it's saving their their bandwidth or something, possibly. Um, this is their old one. Got a feeling. Yes, yeah, so you can see a different version there. The new upgrade. Maybe I haven't. Maybe I haven't. It's just, um, it's just loading. It's going to be a patient session. And if any of you have been on my trains before, you know that I don't do very well with patience, but I am really managing my inner chimp right now because I'm reading my, my new book from um, you know The Chimp Paradox. So I know if I was to get aggro right now, it would be my chimp taking over. It's a great book. Come on, that can't be it. No, there we go. Uh, it's not looking good. I really thought I had it. Obviously, I have downloaded the, some upgrade pages, but it's obviously not mo not the most up to date one. So I've got a couple of options. Either I've missed it because I was going too quick, or or or, or I go back and try again. So. Let's try again. Let's just go a little bit slower. <laughs> um, and I'm going to close down Mike's Groovathon page at the top. I'm just going to not do anything just for a second to give that a chance to load. So, also, whilst we're going along, please fire any questions in. Please fire them in. Um, Trying to download pages with the source code uh, is a little bit more tricky now than it was. Uh, you can only um, do it if you have the paid account. You can't do it on a free account. It doesn't give you the this little source code button. It, it's, it, it won't work for you. Um, right, so it kind of feels like it's loaded. I'm just gonna give it a second. So let's just click onto the page and let's do control. Hey. Come on. Oh, don't you dare. Why? Why, why, why? Okay, I'm going to get rid of that again. I'm going to try it one more time. Because at least it's loading the code. I might just have to scroll through the whole page and um, copy it, which is kind of feels like it's counterintuitive, but. Okay. I think sometimes you just got to admit that oh, the problem is it's not even showing my cursor, you know, like it's still showing my arrow. How big is it? It's going to be a lot of scrolling. Yeah, you can see how far I've scrolled and yeah. I think it's going to be a bit too complicated. But what I will try and do after the training I'm going to add up my notes doc up here. Is um, I'm going to put download upgrade page. Okay. So I'm going to I'm going to leave that where it is for now. I'm just going to drag that up to the top so I can see it, and I'm going to carry on here. I'm going to get rid of that, and I'm just going to get rid of that, and I'm going to get rid of that page because it's worth nothing to me at the moment. Delete. So. Let's go back to where we were. I was trying to speed things up and all I did was slow them down. Sometimes more haste, less speed. So today, keep reminding me not to go too quick because um, I'll just keep crashing um, the Groove software. So, 
Uh, let me have a look at have they actually updated the C, the Groove CM logo. Doesn't look like they have. So you know what? I think I'm just going to get rid of that. So I'm just going to redo my page. And obviously, I'll I'll total this up in a bit. Uh, let me go back to the top. So I'm going to go with just so you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to use my color picker, and I'm going to pick out the green. And use that as my kind of stronger color. Okay, so you can see my color picker there. And this, I think, is an image that I think I created. I'm going to move my cam for a minute because it's in the way of the screen. Background. Yeah, I think I'd added an image there, so I'm going to remove that. And I think I'm going to just go with this color. Okay. So we've got, we've got green, black, and white. I'm going to get that up there as well. So this yellow I'm going to use instead as well. Okay, I'm going to use that one there instead of that one. So that's probably just a background color. Yeah. So I'm doing this just because of what I want is um, when someone comes to this page. Um, I want them then to go straight through to when they click here, they go straight through to my upgrade page, which is obviously their upgrade page. And I want it to feel like it's all congruent. I want it to feel like, yeah, I'm in the right place. So I'm going to go to the color picker and just grab that gray. And let's use that as a background here. Yeah, let's do that. Click on that block. I can. So again, that's me being impatient. I go there. Oh. Why have I got that very thin like that? I think I did that. Yeah, I think I did that specifically. Why did I do that? Anyway, let's try and see if that will scooch him out. It's not doing that. Hmm. Where is it? That's better. So let's go background color. Okay, just trying to, so again we've got the black there, the white, the, the yellow, let's get, I'm going to maybe grab that, uh, so this is really, this was off the free page, this is probably, I built this in a rush probably at the beginning, so let's um, get lifetime access. So I'm going to drag this up here just for a second because I'm going to model what they've done there. So it's, it's got the same look and feel, although they've got it on the back, a grey background. I'll do away with that. And the other thing is as well, if people who are signed up for my free um, Groove account through my affiliate link, if they've already seen my previous page, then at least this page looks different. So. You know what, I'm gonna move that from there. Let's drag that down to there. It feels better there. And I'm actually gonna stick a countdown timer in the top like they've got. And then that'll be all really, I'll kind of copy at the top here. Let's drag that there. So what have they got 20? Oh no, because their countdown timer at the top of the page so this is where for me and Mike Mike and the guys you know they're not dishonest or anything but for me it's just you've got different countdown times on all different pages like this one's just showing 24 hours so actually scrub that I'm not going to put I don't want to put false scarcity on my page so actually I'm just going to remove that does that make sense guys can you can you understand why I'm doing it? If, it, if that one had had the countdown to the where the price goes up which if I look on the free page it does so look if I drag that back down here so on the actual event page it does show the actual date so now I actually don't mind doing it if my thing will catch up I only pressed back up 
but I, I don't want to be you know creating false scarcity because I don't need to that this deal is actually going away this time um, oh, come on come on come on I'm just gonna try and pop back out of there pop over here this is the problem I have to wait now because my internet's going really slowly. So let me know you can still see and hear me okay, see my screen. Um, it looks like Facebook's running okay, it looks like YouTube's running okay. Say hello you guys over on YouTube as well. Let me know where you're tuning in from. And again, feel free to ask questions. This is just, just me building out uh, my bonuses page. Okay. You're back there okay so you know what I'm just gonna drag in that countdown because it just struggled going backwards and then I'm just gonna up 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 up, up. <laughs> this is the problem when uh, my internet's going slow you see it's not finding that top top uh, block that was there because we just had it there a minute ago anyone else have issues like that a few you know Things where stuff is just a little bit and that's not glitchy it just it won't find you know, I'm just gonna get rid of that top block I really would prefer it to be in there it allowed me a minute ago why is it not allowing me now? Oh, damn you. Okay, cool. So I'm going to give it that yellow color again. And it'll be in my clipboard, but it's easier just to go back in here. And I'm just going to go into each one of these and just change the background color. And then I'll go and configure it and I'll match it up with um, what groove I've got. I want the text color to be black, uh, just to match. Oh, that's blue. It's blue. It's probably this blue. Okay. So I'm just going to do all of the text. Just blue whilst I've got it in my clipboard and then I can go back. And I know I've got my clipboard pro, but you know what? On a day like today where it's all going a bit slow, anything where it's going to have to go and grab something from somewhere, I'm just kind of avoiding because I know it's just going to kick me out and I don't want it to kick me out. So I'm just going to do it this way. I'm going to do it like old school. You've actually got to do one bit at a time. And then I'm going to go back in there and grab that. Sorry. That yellow. Uh, yeah let me know you can still hear and see me on both um, channels guys that'd be cool oh oh that's new oh hello why how did I get there copy styles styles copied oh look at that copy styles paste styles oh hello <laughs> I don't know if anyone else has noticed that before, but that just got me a bit excited, which is kind of sad, isn't it? Uh, I really would still like to drag that up there. So maybe if I just drag a column in there, it may allow me to. Did you guys see that? I know you're a few few seconds behind. That was cool. I like it. Okay, so let's at least drag that up there. I, I, I will round off the edges etc in fact let's just do it i'm not going to cut any corners today um, background sorry where am i text border border sorry sometimes the brain just doesn't really want to 35 looks about right i'm going to add some shadow on this as well box shadow make it extra large what did I say? 35. Does it look okay? Looks okay. Border. 
custom 35, not spacing, <laughs> shadow, no, extra large, same thing. And actually, now I've just realized it would have been more beneficial. And again, I didn't know that was there. If I'd done that at the beginning, look, I should have set up one. Yeah, so again, that's good to know because it is kind of a ball. Like you can see that it's taken me quite a long time. Now I know I'd set this one up so it's actually perfect. And then I'll just go in here and do paste. And then click again and do paste. And then do paste. I love that. That saves you, I mean, that's a good five, 10 minutes. So it's got a shading on the back of all of it. I'm just gonna click on the whole container now or the, the countdown. Let's do a fix. So when is this running out? I'll drag that up there. 14 days, five hours. So, where are we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, maybe midnight. Oh yeah, see, and this has changed as well. I don't know if you guys have noticed this. It says until midnight, or you can put a static time. I'm guessing they're kind of doing a till midnight. Let me see if mine matches up with theirs. This is 14 hours, sorry, 14 days, five hours, 24 minutes, and it will catch up in a second. Bingo. So. Obviously, my timer now matches up with theirs, except I need to make that bold. Yeah, so let's go in and do that, because again, I like to get things right. So, I'm gonna go in there. So I can either come to the weight here, or I could just bold it here. I know it doesn't actually allow me, so let's go into the weight. Let's go bold. And go text again. All right, so let's just do that. So, so again, I've set, I've wasted so much time, really, haven't I? Copy style. So now, again, you learn something every day. I didn't do that. Hang on. Copy style. Paste style. Oh. Okay. That's the only thing it hasn't copied across is the um, the text. That's fine. But um, from now on, I will be doing that. It's kind of cool. I love little things like that where they can save you that extra 10 odd minutes because those 10 minutes all add up. Sorry, send me bold, bold. Okay, so let's just publish that just for a second. Have I got that customer domain, subdomain? yeah because it's on a different one and then what I'll do once I've got it live is I'll make this page my index page yeah because it's on my upgrade.robscrewpagesbonuses.com okay so cool uh, get lifetime access to platinum and I'm gonna um, underline that and uh, anyone else noticed that recently that when you do that, it doesn't automatically bring this up. A couple of times it's done that. Okay. Um, yeah, let me know if you can hear and see me because I, I, I haven't actually got, I've only got live producer and in fact I need to open up another window because I know live producer sometimes is absolutely rubbish. So. Apologies, you may have been commenting, and I'm looking at a comment that Pauline made saying can hear you like 19 minutes ago. And you may not have said anything, but I just want to check. So I'm just opening up another browser window, um, plus how you can get these. And again, I'll, I'll calculate that. So what I do on stuff like this, if I'm trying to do a page, if I know I'm going past this, but I know that I haven't, I need to come back to it, I'll do this, I'll just um, kind of cross it through. So when I get back to it, it's more obvious. I'm just gonna quickly go in and just check that I can see the comments. If I can find my actual group. Oh God, Facebook. Is anyone else getting frustrated with Facebook? It's just really bad. Um, I can't see my own bloody, <laughs> I 
can't see my own life. That's how crazy it is. What the effing hell? <laughs> Uh, all right, I'll be with, back with you in a minute. So I'm going into my Groove Pages tutorial group just to check the chat. And then we're going to continue on. And obviously this color, I'm going to switch out for black probably now. In fact, I'll do that whilst we're waiting for my thing to load. I'm just going to change that color text. So they've got two different, oh, text stroke. This is new by the looks of it. Don't know what text stroke is. Interesting. Hmm, no idea, no idea. So I'm gonna go in here. This should be changing this color to unless I've actually done it over here which I may have done I may have had to okay oh I don't know that good me no likey <laughs> and sometimes when you've built a page in a in an old builder or something like that uh, old version of their builder you are going to get some of these issues it may be that I'm either I've got to get some space in below here or this one bit annoying but it is just the way it is so I'm just gonna to go to the end there and just drop that down just see if that space is okay I'm gonna keep saving just because I know I've got issues with my tinternet and I'm still trying to get into my um, my page just so I can actually view the live so if you have been commenting I'm so sorry So slow, so slow. Everything's slow. Uh, comments. Comments. It will just, I'll start talking Internet. in a second. I'll stop I'm myself. I'm trying to get into my, um, my page just so I can. Oh my God. Live. So if you have been commenting, I'm so sorry. Facebook. Wow. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's any other comments unless it's just loading really slowly, which we know it is. So I will re-record this because obviously now I want that gray color, remember, because we've got that gray here. I want that background color because obviously I had originally the, the white that I want to mix and match now. So this block here needs to have that background as well. Doesn't need, but I'm gonna. So that all merges in, uh, get these blah, blah, blah. Let's just do that again there, just so I don't forget. So I'll need to add up what bonuses I'm adding. Uh, upgrade to Louvre Groove Lifetime. Uh, you can, your complete digital product services online system. I'm gonna put this because I like this. I'm just copying this from the page up there. I'm gonna think you know what I'm going to do I'm going to put this at the top so I'm going to drag that up a little bit like they've got it and then I'm going to clone this line here and drag that up and then I'm going to paste in the two lines here because that for me is like the be all and end all these two things here. No monthly payments ever. In fact, I'm gonna make all of that black. Okay, it doesn't make all of it black, but we will make all of it black. Sometimes it needs to have things selected. It's kind of, has a mind of its own sometimes. Um, and I know on theirs, which I love to do this, I would definitely, crisscross that out so just quickly then um, yes you're hearing me just quickly just let me know that you can start getting a feel of um, you know we're trying to just match this up and, and I'm, I'm doing it quite quickly I'm not I'm not normally I take a lot more time to do this kind of thing but 
you know, if someone comes from here, they're gonna obviously change all these buttons to the, whatever the color of the button is over here, the yellow, um, they're, gonna, they're gonna understand that they're on the right page, okay? So, um, let's go and grab that yellow. So I will keep this down here. I know, I know I'm saying I wanna just, it's eat, normally because I've got six screens, I would normally have this up there so I wouldn't have to keep opening up different windows, but just for the, the sake of this, because you guys are actually watching this on the replay or a few of you are watching live and a few of you on YouTube, it just makes much more sense for me to actually do it right in front of you so you can see what I'm doing. And then if anyone needs to, they can slow it down and, and do what they need to afterwards. Kind of a little bit garish on that gray, isn't it? So they've got it on the white. So, I think, I think what I am going to do is go back to, I think I'm gonna, let me see if I can do this. So I'm gonna bring in a column because I'd, ideally I'd like to have the white background behind this and then just the gray background. Now in the click farts, as, as I call them now, I still love click funnels, but in click farts, it was a lot easier. In Groove, it's a little bit more difficult. Um, so let's just drag in a few bits into that container. Let's just say, oh, it looks like all of that is, it can't be all of it, surely. Oh, so there's a larger container there. So it depends on, depends what I've built in it. Yeah, so I'm in text. And then if I go up one, I'm in the container I just dragged in. But actually, I didn't notice that I already had a layout one and then a container there. So let's do the background on that as white. Now, it's not going to show. And then let's do the background on this. Let's see if it'll allow me. As I say, this is where on click farts it was a lot easier. I think the grey slim my. No, it's not the grey, it's the yellow. And again, I would normally, in fact, I should do, I'd normally put these on a little notes doc so I don't have to keep doing this going backwards and forwards. So let me just add them up there because it seems very lazy for me to do that. So that's great. So let me just change that back to that. So I could now, if I go up, uh, where am I? I'm in the layout and then I want to be in that container. Let me see what that top container is. Let's go there. No, okay, that's not the one. I wanted this one around about here. So you can see it's on the outskirts there. So I've got that as a, the background. Let's go for a gutter width, extra large. Come on, group, you've got this. And let's go. Do a lot, did it? You know what? I'm making it making it harder than I need to. Let's just go back to what we were doing. Let's leave it as all grey background. That yellow, I'll just put a board around it. That's fine. It's easier. Although this is getting a little bit slow. This when I click back up, I'll try and be patient. Let's get into building out like the bonus pack. Um, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> they need this to do something. They need this to have like, um, you know, it's filling. Because if this was filling and I knew it was here, I knew I'd just got to wait a little bit longer. But at the moment, it's like, sometimes I sit there for 10 minutes and it's like, doesn't do anything. So, you know, what do I do? Do I do what I did earlier and go back out, go into a different page and then come back and then have I lost all my work or, I know it's saving, let's try. 
I just feel like it doesn't give me enough information. I want it to tell me what it's doing. Again, this is my impatience. I can't sit here and wait. Okay, so I've gone out of that page. I'm going to get back into that page. So I'm just going to go into that container that I was in. I'm just going to change that background back to what it was, which was my grey. Let's just suck it up. Instead of going too slow to dick around. Okay. So all I'm going to do now is go in here. What colours there? Button over here. It's got black on it. So let's go with the text on the black and let's go with the border around it just so it makes it pop a little bit more. Let's go there, let's go there, let's just give it a two for now and see how that looks. And it's got it's got all the, the yeah, it's just the bottom of it, this must just be you know what, let's give it some padding just below, a tiny smidge. Not padding, spacing. So that, that buttons you see how now it's got the the thick line all the way around it that's better okay cool so let's do the same thing now obviously you can in here it wasn't really working before let's try it let's do create new style let's call it upgrade uh, upgrade page button let's save it going to publish that just because it might crash and let's try and see if um, if it's still a bit glitchy okay the only thing it did do is it changed the size of the text so let's just go okay it needs some spacing so it must have been the spacing that was more likely. <laughs> All the way around. Okay, that's not changing anything. You know what, again for now, let's just go and configure the thumbs up. things like that for me if I'm changing this sizing here that should just stretch the button out that shouldn't make that text go outside the button just my opinion um, because it just it doesn't look right so that should be changing the color of the hmm. and again because this is an old button that's probably why it is it's because it's an old button and now they've updated the buttons and obviously without me changing that it didn't do anything so let's go with a larger thumbs up and even that's gone look that's one of the things i don't love about the button is it automatically kind of gets rid of everything and obviously this here we'll need to make sure we've got our url our upgrade url so is that making sense so far? Let me know. Uh, let me see, icon horizontal. And even that, I don't like that. I'm trying to edit this here and I can't see it. Horizontal distance, uh, vertical distance. I liked it when you could just, now I could make that thumb bigger, but I'm pretty sure got to do it on the X got to do it over here still it's a bit of a ball like it is what it is now that might make that button too big and really what I probably should have done is I probably yeah I should have I should have dragged in a new button because obviously that button is a defunct button it's an old version so let's drag that in and it will be super quick all I've got to do is copy the settings across. Um, 
looking great. Uh, is it Nim? Uh, I don't know if I'm saying your name right. Can you please try to send the source code again? Yeah, it was just crashing Nim. Um, so unfortunately, I'm going to have to do it afterwards. So just grab that. What did I have a thumb? We've got the color. I can grab the color in a second. So I'm just going to. And also, they've done this. Have you seen this? Button main label uh, and then button. So it's kind of separated the two. Which again, I'm not sure why when you can edit the main label here anyway. So, yeah. And also, I don't like the fact that all of the things disappear. So if I get rid of that, there's nothing there. There's nothing to choose from. If you don't know the name of an icon, then how are you supposed to find it? And now this has changed. Look. <laughs> it's all good fun. All good fun. So I'm going to go black with that. And I'm going to link it to a page, but I don't have... I might already be there. It's there somewhere, so that'll be possibly my dock. I will need to double check it afterwards because this is probably an old direct upgrade page. But let me just check. I'm pretty sure if you've got an old one that it will automatically redirect to the more updated one. So that is my ID. No, that's going to the free. Okay. So I do need to go and grab it. Okay, that's fine, I'll come back to that. Let's grab it now, and then we don't leave it. Let's scroll down. You can just see everything struggling to load. And this is not loading correctly. See how it's just not quite right. This should load um, and the whole thing should be visible. So I might send in a request uh, or a bug request for the guys. Uh, last chance price increase, that's the groove So I want this one. Yes, that's annoying. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Strange. So I'm going to copy my link. I'm going to stick it into my button. I'm going to carry over that. Click update. And let's see how that button works. And then we'll grab the other color. Okay. So I'm just going to pop back in here. background there and let's get back in over here come on speed up so I want the background and then I'm going to mess around with the text and then hopefully we should find that this one will with the text go black it should do exactly what we said so that's what it should do is because this is an old one so we need to do our border around here as well the same as the last one so we did two and black and I probably would put a bit of shading below it okay and didn't do the border. Huh. Strange. And we didn't do that. 35. So that should now be the same. The only thing I would change would be the text I would make bold. Boom. Yeah. So now we can do away with this one. This one is defunct. So yeah, just remember that if you're building out pages and you've got old um, buttons like this one, um, and what I'll probably do is save that again 
as a separate version. Create a new style. Clean upgrade button. Okay. So then when I find it further down, these will be all my bonuses, which I'm going to add in here. I need to keep moving that gray all the way down, which is the hex code is there. Hmm. That's not got a green thing in there, so I wonder if that is not that. Normally it's got a little green. Hmm, interesting. Let's carry on. Maybe there's more sections that need the grey. There is. And you see this black obviously fits with um, with the, their page, so that's cool. Saves us some work. Might as well just finish these off here. I can switch the buttons out. And then it's really just now adding uh, the additional bonuses. should not take as long at all for some reason I've got this as a white background here see how it's a great little green logo there I don't know why it didn't have it on the blocks because I kind of like that it's kind of helpful trying to figure out where your colors are etc want that block hmm, strange Okay, so page, colors, all, etc. I'm gonna change that one there to black. Just because I think it will pop more, that's cool. I'm gonna publish it, just for now. And then I'm gonna switch this one out because we know, um, I've got a feeling if I do it there, yeah, I'm going to do what I did last time. I'm going to bring in a new button and then just use the style. I think that's going to be the quicker route. I think if I try it on there, it won't work. Uh, and again, if you're watching on the replay, you know, ask any questions, let, let me know what queries, issues, etc. you have. I keep clicking that text in the middle because I'm not used to it being a like a double click. Um, global style, new button. Ooh. Oh, that's sucky. It doesn't bring anything else in. Hmm. I don't like that. Me not like it. So I suppose, yeah. I expected that to bring everything in, which it didn't. What do we have? Three. We had black. We had link, which was here. Let's so add that up there on the dock. Save time. Day. Then we can go in and change the border and the background, etc. Oh, I didn't like that. See, this is what I find sometimes in here. It doesn't accept things like this when I've pasted it in, unless I press like a space bar and then come back. It kind of just doesn't pick it up. I'm hoping this time it will. It's done that a few times and I, I forget that. See if it picks up this time. Yeah. So let's go back up here. Let's go into text. Let's go into the weight, make it bold. And we're there. Okay. And we just get rid of that one. So we're not a million miles off finishing this page. It's just now switching out. And obviously, we'll do the same here. I could just easily just change the color of the background and the text there just to make it easier. Although I haven't got the, um, the 
the yellow. It was something like that. <laughs> I will go back in and change it. See again, the problem is, is this is an old one. Don't like this. And this is called, it's not a tick. I was trying to find it the other day. See, I mean, how's that not a tick? It's a, oh, I don't like the fact that, that you can't just scroll through them. Why they move them? That's ridiculous. I want to find all the ones that I don't even know are there. How am I supposed to be able to name them? And that's definitely something I need to put in a bug report because that is now I can't find anything. And I remember I found it the other day, but it wasn't because um, I knew what it was called. It's because I just started typing random letters and I had to search all the way through. I can't remember what they, what they call it. I mean, this should not take this long. I think I, I randomly went through a load of letters and then eventually found it, but that should not. I mean, it's like a double one there. Is that it? No, it's not. It's close. Come on, Groove. Silly little things like that. You can't take something away where before I could just scroll and or if I knew the name, I could type. Can't go backwards on things. Like now I am struggling to find what I need. There it is. That should not take that long. That was really bad. Well, that is really bad. And again, because it's an old button, this layout slightly different. Again, I'm going to grab my updated URL. Click confirm. Let's see if that's worked. I probably would, once I come off here and I finish it, I probably will go back in and update all of these buttons. So I'm not going to do that now because we know that, that they need updating. Okay, let's go back to the top for a second. Come on, scroll, scroll, scroll. Okay. Oh yeah, of course, all of these have got a white background. So we might be able to get away with making this one container here. Mm. Let's see how far this container goes. Yeah, that's what I suspected. Okay, so I don't mind having this when we go to the more bonuses. I don't mind changing that to white. So let's do the container. It might be the layout. Let's have a look. Let's change the background there and see what happens. And then let's try here. I think it's going to be layout layout two of two, I think. Let's see if that goes, okay. That looks all right. Yeah, it's just a shame some of those uh, bonuses that I've got, they're just on a white background already. Some of them I've got are on, um, okay. It's a, it's a sort of fixed. I'm oh, sorry, let me click down here. So you can see slowly but surely we're getting down through here. It's just another few bonuses there. Layout two of two. Background white. Okay, there's lots. Two, two, and I'll probably finish the white down here, and then have that button on there, and then maybe, maybe even border it off. Let's have a look. Yeah, what I might do is try and see that one layout container there, and I might put a little border on the bottom just so it feels like it's kind of finishing. Let's put a little. 
bottom. Okay. Let's have a look at that. And then just move that button up a smidge. Okay. Cool. That's okay. So that's kind of fixed the, the issue of the backgrounds there. I'm just going to publish that. So let's go and um, I'm happy to leave these bonuses in. What I'm going to do is just I'm going to switch some of these out and add additional ones. Um, I'm going to Thing. I was going to give away, I'm not sure if I'm going to give this one away now, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to do some bonus live sessions. So I'm going to switch these out. Oh yeah, I do do catch talks. So I'm going to paste that in there. Now the other question is, can we do all capitals? Because I'd like that to, I'd like to be able to just make all of that capitals now. Doesn't seem like we can. Just means you've got to type it out, which is all right. So these are sessions I'm doing with some of my masterminders. So I'm giving these away as, um, as an additional bonus, showing people how to hire um, and outsource uh, a dream team. And they will end up being packages that I'll sell. And I think I'm still gonna sell this one for 495. So again, I'll add the image here. I'll put a description here and then I'll change that there. To 495 497 sorry then the second one is going to be social media domination blueprint so obviously I'll switch this image I'll do the same on here sell that one for 297 which is fine and obviously there's no point in me just sitting here trying to retype out that I'll, I'll put that afterwards and obviously I'll, I'll put a different image in there um, so that's those two there and I'm gonna give away my surefire attraction templates it's like 48 different uh, email campaigns And you can see how slowly my internet's going. So um, as I say, I'd love to be able to go in and do all of this, um, but it just is going so slow. Short bar attraction, oops. Email templates. Cool. I mean, they are worth four nine seven of anyone's money. I sell them for more than that. Four nine seven. Again, let's just publish that. So now, what I want to do is have a quick look at the upgrade again. I don't think they're offering anything additional here because this has been um, like this for. A few weeks or maybe a month or so plus double your affiliate payout but okay that was fine start selling I just want to see if they're giving any additional bonuses away and then I'll look on the the two um, the groove -thon page so free to get a groove con which is cool but that's not something I can add to 
and claim your lifetime group account lifetime okay so they're not actually adding that there so let me just have a quick look over here Go back up. Yeah, and that's a bit annoying where my internet's going slow and it's kind of playing catch up. It shouldn't really do that. So, Mike's giving away a funnels masterclass. Um, so again, what I'm thinking now is I want to be smart. You know, I've got loads of other bonuses, but I want to support these people. So actually, instead of this top one here, what I'm thinking of is supporting this one um, where I can do like a weekly call uh, or bi-weekly call to support people in understanding this masterclass so it's giving my time on a webinar so you know, if I have 20 people who upgrade there's 20 people who can jump on where I can go through this with them and, and fix their problems fix their issues so let me put um, going slow now <laughs> funnels masterclass mini mastermind okay and then obviously I'll rewrite this and I'll change this image and then I'll be explaining to people look you know if you buy right now you're getting the funnels masterclass and actually I'll probably just grab that uh, it might not let me that might do I'll add that there so that, that, that they know what I'm talking about let's put this in uh, let's put in bonuses funnels masterclass let's switch that out there and obviously I'll put in the video look this is what I'm going to do I'm going to support you with you know um adding additional value by doing this and then this here will just be to back it up I think I just put that it was in here put it in bonuses no because that is the, the bonus I was originally given is a two thousand dollar course that we're just about to launch and I'm kind of cutting my nose off a little bit because it's not even launched yet so let's do that So again, I'll explain down here what we, they're going to get in regards to that. Um, and we'll leave that at one nine nine seven because you know my my mastermind is two nine nine seven. I don't know; they're probably going to be a three months worth of um, support with them. Um, so we've got the mastermind mini mini mastermind masterclass. Okay, we've got um, the live sessions, which again are going to be hands-on with me live sessions asking Q&A's uh, there's another one there why that value is over there oh it is there okay and then they've got the surefire attraction templates I'll give them my blog traffic avalanche training course they can have my benefit logic scarcity email campaign this is an engagement series they can have my access to uh, how to build the perfect funnel training course and my best email subject lines, which is really cool. I'll give them a bonus 60 minute complimentary call with me where I can help them map things out and build stuff out. And this one I'm gonna change. I'm gonna give them specific ones instead of just saying all, because that's not relevant. Um, where's my thing gone? Actually, I'll modify that one in a minute. And then I'm gonna add a few more so all I'm going to do is um, clone this block here, or not block this container, and it's ready. And I'm nearly there. I basically want this layout two of two, which is that. So I want to clone that. dropper is still a little bit too let me just see if I land that a bit. I don't know 
where that dropped. That's really rubbish. I don't like the, the, the dropper just, I mean like, that. where's that gone? I was dragging it and it just sort of just, it's gone. So has it gone somewhere or has it, it's pretty bad. I mean really, that double uh, layout, that layout two, should have a little arrow there. I've said this to David Lemon, should have a little arrow just um, so I can, I basically want to put it down below here so that I've got, because I like rotating the images either side. It just feels a nicer flow. So I'm going to click back up and see if it'll allow me to try it again. I just don't get why they wouldn't put arrows on there. It's not in the way. Oh, let me just realize that backup wasn't working. Oh. So I'm going to drag my dock down because you know what? I'm going so, so, so slow. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, additionally, I'm going to add um, access to my VIP backstage pass from my previous, my recent 10 day Groovy Challenge. Uh, it's got $2,000 worth of bonuses in there as well. So I'll add that as a bonus. I'm going to add some of these uh, FX Visual Eclipse, Influencers Hub and Octane and Snappy Shop. So I'm going to add them in here, but I'm also going to add, um, when this finishes, come on. Uh, I've just started um, using a trading bot on Bitcoin. Um, I know nothing about Bitcoin, don't need to. Uh, after the setup, which um, I'm going to help people with, I'm going to give everyone who upgrades through me, uh, through this page, I'm going to give them the trading bot that we will be selling for $2,000. So like that, actually, I probably will put as the top, top bonus, even though it kind of is not really relevant to a person buying groove every single person behind groove i believe still wants passive income um and as i said the entire time we've been sitting here working uh, my trading bot has been doing its thing doesn't matter whether it goes up or down it does it, it buys and sells it does all of this automatically so you can see whilst we've been on here if i refresh this page if it'll allow me it's going so slow that it might just crash you'll be able to see that my bot has been trading for me and making me money and I know nothing about Bitcoin. So a few people have, uh, have asked me about it and then a few people have gone, oh yeah, I don't know anything about Bitcoin. It makes no difference, neither do I. My best friend uh, who built this for himself, he's allowed me to give um, a few copies of this away. So it will be a limited amount of people will get this, but I'll probably then be doing a weekly training with those people as well. There's nothing really, so there's like 20 minutes set up in the morning so you can see here, if I look at the trade history, what's the time? 7.22. So we started this training at 6 o'clock. So at 6.02, 6.07, 6.14, 6.30, 6.59, 7.08, it made trades, okay? And it then bought other things. Uh, so it bought and sold, okay? So you can see this is my grid. None of this makes any sense to me. I don't need it to. It just basically means that I've got sell set up, buy set up, and my bot then, every time one happens, it triggers something else and it does stuff in the background. It's freaking awesome. It's making me money every day at the moment without me doing anything. So that is like the biggest bonus that I'm gonna give. Um, it's really annoying. That backup button is just taking it like an eon. So that's pretty much it. I'm gonna tidy it up. I'm gonna finish the bonuses page. The other thing that I forgot, in fact, let me add it on my doc, is I'm actually gonna give people who upgrade through my link, I'm gonna give them my bonus page, this one I'm building and the previous one, and I'm gonna give them all of the bonuses to give away. So uh, let me see what it did there, let's have a look. Which one did I clone? I cloned this one, but it looks like it hasn't. And now this is playing up. Again, this is an old page, so it's probably gonna have these kind of glitches in it because, as I said, where they've updated the builder. See, look, even things like that, because it's an old um, text block, it won't do anything. It's just, it's, it's a real shame because, you know, if you've built a lot of pages like we have for clients and for us, there's a lot of pages now that need rebuilding. But it is part and parcel of it. It's, um, we were in beta. I'm going to try and see if it'll allow me to do that way. Sometimes it doesn't. There you go. So I'll just bring that down a little bit. There normally is a little workaround. Um, and normally you can figure it out. So yeah, I'm gonna add those additional bonuses. I'm gonna try and 
to try one. Oh, what's up from there? Oh, I'm in the wrong one. Of course, it's, that's why it's a different bonus then. Hello, McFly. Sorry, people. Sorry. I know there's not a huge amount of you on, maybe five or six on YouTube. A few were on, on Facebook. I can't see because they're not on my screen. Uh, I'm just going to have a quick look. Yeah, so it, it didn't. Oh, look, it's, it's got like a drop here. I mean, I, I dropped it, but anyway, you get the gist. So I'm going to add these additional bonuses in there. Uh, I'm going to add the, the bot at the top here because it is, it's passive. You know, I, my friend doesn't name it. I'm probably going to name it something around passive income bot, and this will be the second bonus here. And it is going to be a two to $3,000 product. Uh, I've seen lots of them being sold recently for much more than that. And again, I'm probably going to add additional training to that bot so that I'm going to help people set it all up. I'm going to be doing a weekly training just showing you the 10, 20 minute setup in the morning and how you can then compound your income. Um, and just to give you an idea, I might as well turn my cam back on now. Hello, it's over here. Just to give you an idea, I've only been using it for like not even a week yet, um, but my friend's been testing it, using it for the last two months. He made um, about 13% month one profit. So he's got a 100K bank. He made $13,000 in month one. And this month so far, he's on about $12,000 profit. With the rest of the month to go, he anticipates about 15% on 100K. Now, obviously, if you start computing that and you then compound it, so month one he made is 13K, whatever it was, he put that back in. So month two, um, his bank is now 113,000. By the end of this month, it'd be 127,000. So you can see the compound, it just gets bigger and bigger and he has more trades every day and more money in there. And <coughs> so it kind of, it's, it's really exciting. So um, yeah, I can't wait to get in there and show you guys. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna finish this page off. I will do the upgrade page and I'll give you a copy of that inside of here. So if I actually, I will try and do it again now, but as I said, it was struggling, but I will try and then I'm gonna wrap up. And uh, if any of you haven't already upgraded, then please um, come and grab my bonuses. Uh, I'm pretty sure <laughs> um, the page won't be live yet because obviously I haven't finished it and I haven't made it. Um, I haven't made it the index page, but what I'll do again, please just email me at support funnels qualified if you want to upgrade. And obviously you'd need to do a few of the things that it says on the page, clearing your, your cookies and your cache and things like that to make sure that I get credit for it. Because if I don't get credit for it, I can't give you the bonuses. Uh, and I want to give you the bonuses. I want to get, uh, I, I think at the moment I'm thinking, just from what my friend said, I'm allowed, I'll probably be allowed to give away 20 copies of the software. And this software for the trading bot, it, it's on your, local drive so once we've done the bits we need to we need to give you some coding and some things that you need to do then um, it runs on your computer it's not like an online thing you, you have to set up a, a binance account which again we show you how to do we give you all of the stuff we give you a link to to, to do it um, so i'm going to try this one more time Let's see i mean before i've even clicked it it's, it's already doing that probably struggling to, to load it all because this will probably be like 10,000 lines down. If I start doing it, you'll see it'll just crash. So I will do this after. So look down in the comments. I'll probably add it when I'm talking about it. Um, so it'll be a, a share link so you can grab the upgrade page if it, up, if it lets me copy it across properly because they don't all. Um, if you haven't upgraded already, then just, um, comment down below or just private message me or email me at support funnels qualified if you want all of these bonuses including the trading bot uh, it's going to probably be like 15k's worth of bonuses and again uh, any other questions just pop them down in the, in the comments that's it i'm going to leave you to it and i'm going to hopefully once i stop streaming my computer will slow down and my internet will speed up and i'll be able to grab the source code and copy that page so that's it from me anything else you need just ping me in this group uh, and I'll speak to you soon. All right, bye for now.